Assalamualaikum and hi, hi. everyone. Me Normawani binti Muhammad Said and, and hi Siti Anza binti Anwar. We are going to handle uh, first experiment of our group uh, about diffusion. So what the title? The title of this experiment is Ocean in the Bottle. Okay, now we introduce the apparatus that we ah the first firstly the objective of this experiment. Okay, uh, for this experiment we have two objectives. Mm -hmm. The first one is to study about the about how diffusion takes place in two different components which is water and cooking oil. The second one is to study about to study about the how density will affect the rate of diffusion. Okay, let us introduce them our apparatus for the experiment. Firstly, we got to have an empty bottle. Okay, and, and then uh, we need to have clear water, mm -hmm. cooking oil, scissor, stirrer, and last, last but not least, uh, ink color. And not to forget our filter final. Filter final. Okay. So, to treasure more about how this fusion take place, let's start our experiment. Okay. Firstly, we have to add it in into the water. Add a few drops of blue color into the water. Okay. See now? Okay. As you can see, the blue color uh, is high concentration at, at here and low concentration at the rest of the at the rest water. of the water. So next we will stir the solution. Let's add more color. To make blue ocean. Okay, why I just treat this uh, solution? Solution. Uh, let Let me explain what actually happens in this solution. Actually, when we first in, uh, when we first add the color into the water, uh, the particles are initially are together in one side of the water. Then after we stir the particles are randomly moved and diffused into the water uniformly. Uh, okay. Particle distribute randomly and uniformly. Okay. Then, as you can see now, the blue color uh, is well mixed with the clear color before. And it turns the water, the clear color into blue color water. Next. Okay. Let's move to the next step. Insert the blue color into the empty bottle. Okay, then uh, we add up. Uh, Cooking oil. Cooking oil. The below one is the, uh, the the blue color water, and the above one is the cooking oil. Okay. Okay. As you 
can see the difference uh, the difference layer of this is occur because of the density as we know the density of uh, the water is higher than the cooking oil so the the blue color water will sink at the bottom of the bottle and the cooking oil will float at the float, float in, the in the bottle okay okay let's see the ocean wave as you can see even after one hour this um this mixture will never mix uh, because of the density is different and the particle is different between the two components as you can see if we shake it or or vigorously it, it will not mix at all okay for the conclusion we know that this type of motion when molecule move from their higher concentration to the lower concentration of uh, <coughs> liquid is what we call diffusion and the sec for the second objective the conclusion is when high density the, the component will move will be sink and when it has less density it will be float at the surface That's all from us and let's move to the next experiment. Hi everyone, I'm Nusha Pika and this is my friend Nusha Pika. Hello! Okay, today we will show you how to handle the absorption of paper towel. Okay, basically we will show you how the absorb work and how much the water absorb of paper towels on which a certain amount of time. Before I briefly explain about the absorption of paper towel, I would like to give some explanation and information. Since paper towel are used to pick up liquid, the volume of liquid it can hold is important. The amount of liquid of towel can absorb can be measured by the volume of liquid it picks. For the objective, there are two objectives uh, from the experiment. First is to measure the amount of water absorbed and the second is to measure the, the time it takes to, what, to paper towel to absorb water. Now I will proceed to the material. For the uh, for that material that we use in this experiment is first are the three gases that we need, second tissue, third the colouring and water, and the last one is top wash. Okay. Okay. Now I will show you how to handle this experiment. First, I uh, put the water in the uh, first glass and the third glass. Okay. Second. I uh, put the color, the coloring that we uh, need. First, the blue color. And the second one is the red color. Okay. Let the the middle become empty glass. So, uh, this is the result that we can obtain uh, after the absorption do the color okay uh, now as you can see uh, this is the different uh, color which a uh, red color and the blue color okay now okay now I make this tower into a string like this And 
put at the both side for the red color let a bridge and for the blue let a bridge too ok now uh, ok now it, it looks like this experiment you will see how the water traveling to the middle cup and the and the second color red and the blue which is going to be mixed color and become a purple color That's this result we must wait about 30 minutes to obtain the absorption from the bridge uh, for the blue cup into the middle cup and the third, uh, third cup which for the red cup the purple looks will burden this a small red purple and also water level change which red cup and purple cup seem be elevated red cup and travel down to the middle cup here so this cup has highest level and the blue doesn't not change a bit the conclusion we can conclude that the thicker the towel uh, the more absorption will absorb that's all bye